am I'm blown away this morning because of this training. I, I love it. I will never miss a Saturday training ever, ever. Anytime you open your mouth, I'm going to be there to listen and soak it up because you just tweaked and changed so much in my mindset in just these last 15 minutes. So I hope everybody on the line really, um, and I, I'm sure they do appreciate what it is that you bring to the table. So thank you so much for all that you do with this community. You have literally changed my life with your leadership and I appreciate you so much. Um, one of the things that I'll share with you guys, um, people, m many people may know that my background is real estate. Um, everything from, I wrote mortgages for 15 years. I worked as a developer's consultant. I raised funds for developers um, for their projects all over the country. I did that till the bottom fell out of the real estate industry. And, um, and I'm, I'm an entrepreneur, so I've had a few businesses since then. But I can tell you when I met Greg Baldwin back 15 years ago or so um, in an in a opportunity and he was in front of the room giving a, 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 a training such as this, my chin was on my chest because I had never heard anything like it um, before. I, I, my mouth was agape and, um, and it changed how I thought. Up until that time, I had been working for money. Literally, I didn't realize that I was a employee. I was an employee. I was just my own boss, and it wasn't um, it wasn't great. I mean, I was able to make a living for myself and my family, but I wasn't really living. And you taught me something back then about leverage. You taught me how to leverage the efforts of other people. You taught me how to leverage my money. You taught me how to leverage systems and it changed everything. You taught me the most valuable thing um, was my time and how to create, you know, if, if Nicole, you told me if Nicole, if what you're doing, it requires you to be there all the time, you're doing something wrong, you don't own your life. And from then I created a lifestyle ever since then, I'll, I'll never do anything differently. Um, that would allow me the time freedom to do exactly what it is that, that I want to do with my life. And I'm so thank you, th thankful to you for that education. So, you, you know, a lot of this, you know, what we're doing is like, oh, well, you can bring home this kind of money. It's not about the, the amount of money. Sometimes it's about the quality of the money. All right. And with this quality of money, um, what, which, which, what I'm sharing with um, the family today is the life that, lifestyle I've been able to live. You guys saw this summer. Um, this summer, I was able to travel. Um, I, one of my favorite things to do is travel. So I was able to travel to Mexico for two weeks and just enjoy my time there, um, partially with my family and then partially just by myself, having that time to just renew and relax because my family couldn't stay the whole two weeks with me. They can only stay one week. My sisters could only get away from their jobs and families for a week. And I was able to still stay and, and spend that additional week in Mexico. And um, and then I came back for a couple of weeks and then I went back out on the road. And I, you know, I bought a couple of years ago, I bought myself an RV for my birthday. So I traveled um, for two weeks, I traveled with uh, down to St. Louis and got my sister, and then we traveled all the way to California. You know, for a week, we we went to Lake Tahoe and uh, Utah, and all we just had an amazing, amazing experience. Um, my nephew just um, graduated from high school and is going to, you know, he's taking a gap year. Uh, he's got money and all that. He's going to college, but he's taking a gap year. Um, and it was powerful for me because this might be the last time that I get to spend with my nephew. As he becomes an adult, you know, you don't get a lot of time with these kids when they go to college and go off. So I got a chance to really, you know, teach him some things about how to care for the RV. And it was just an amazing experience to have with my nephew. And then, you know, my oldest sister, we got to bond, of course. And, um, and unfortunately, while I was out there, my mother was hospitalized. And so I flew back home and, um, and you know, we got her home from the hospital, but I fortunately, because I have this time freedom, I've been able to care for my mom. I put her on a raw food diet. Um, I'm the one who is the raw chef. So I put her on a raw food diet. I'm over there every day, making sure she's fed, 
making sure that, you know, her housekeeping and all that stuff that needs to be done, handling all her PT, OT, all that stuff with her practitioners. But I have the time freedom to do what is most important to me, which is take care of who I love, my mother. So if I was, you know, my, my business and all that stuff is, can sit on the back burner because I've created that lifestyle the t- with the time freedom. And I just hope that everybody on the line, I'm not saying any of this stuff to brag, you know, about a lifestyle. What I'm saying is it's important. It is important to invest the time right now into creating a system where the funds come into the house, where you have the time freedom to take care of the thing that's the most important thing, which is our health. Because sometimes, I, especially from Detroit, I, we, we, we got a lot of people out here who make a lot of money, are entrepreneurs, all that stuff, but are completely not taking care of the health, you know? So because they're so busy with other things, trying to make money, it's not what it is. So I hope that I, I have um, impressed that fact upon our family that this is worth it. This is worth it. And this Definitely. money, the don't, this system works. So thank you so much, Greg, for allowing me to share. I appreciate, I cannot say enough about what it is that you sow into our lives. I appreciate you. I mean, 